trying to do this. She back to sleep. You know, I'm good caretaker. Okay, that. Okay, here, look, listen. I'll, I'll, I I'll just, do not know what listen, is going I'll, on. I'll just come back another day when you need me. Yeah. The baby's a little off. Baby nurse is a little off. None of my other kids were like this. I really do not know what's going on. I don't know if I can even keep her. I'm not really <sighs> sure what to do. Maybe I'll keep her another couple years. Maybe I won't. Oh, sweetheart, I need you to be able to have a snack. How about this one? No. <laughs> Ella, stop being difficult. How about this one? All the kids really, really like this one. No, I want some real food, not whatever that is. <sighs> Why do you always have to be so incredibly difficult? Ella, I need you to have one of those snacks just to hold you over because I'm fixing this later on for dinner. This is what I want. Mine. I need this raw meat. What are you doing? Uh, oh, what is going on here? No, but I need this raw uh, meat. What is going on? Give it to me. It's my food. No, it's mine. Ella, honestly. Like, it is so frustrating. Like, these past 10 years have been the most difficult for me of any of my children. I just can't do this anymore. No, I, I, I just can't. I, I don't want to hear it. No, I don't want to hear it. Please, No, you can't. No, Mom, I'm going to have to take you to the orphanage. Please don't leave me. I know you're too young for this, but I just, I can't do this anymore. I just, I, I, I'm at my wit's end. I don't know what to do. So please. this is my last thing. No, Mom, don't leave me. I have to. But no. you know what? Before I go, Ella, I'm going to give this to you. It's really, really important, and you could only read this on your deathbed. Please don't leave me. No, you have to listen to me. It contains really important information, and it will explain everything. I want to stay with you, Mom. Please, Mom. Oh, no! Please don't leave Mom! No! What up, new girl? Your parents didn't want you either? Mom, why do you look so dead? She's such a freak. Girl! Stop it right now! This is your new sister! She will never be my sister. Whether you like it or not, I better see you treating her with respect. She because needs to earn my respect. Guess what? Your parents didn't want you just like they didn't want her. You're all stuck in this horrible orphanage with me. Whether you like it or not. Um, can I get a chair too? No! You have not earned a chair! You have not proven that you were worthy of sitting. Everything in this orphanage is earned. And you know what happens if you decide to miss with me? <laughs> so I punch you back? It's gonna be you. Hey, freak. What are you doing? What is she even wearing? I don't know. What is she drinking? Blood. She's like a vampire or something. Ew. Whatever she is, she's totally freaky. Yeah. I mean, I've seen her hang out with that Edwin kid. I don't even know how he's hanging out with her. I mean, he's like so hot. Why would she hang out with someone like her? Yeah, he's hot, but he's pretty pale. Yeah. See you later, freak. Why did you do that? You're so weird. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no way. Hi, Ella. Edwin, what do you want? I was just 
seeing how you're doing. No, I'm good. Those girls just continue to bully me and I can't do anything right. I'm just trying to mind my own business. They just keep coming and being so mean to me for no reason. I'm sorry. I just wish I was like everyone else. I wish I was like the pretty popular girls. I'm sure things are going to get better. Ella, don't leave. Hi, Ella. Thank you again. What do you want this time? I just can't stay away from you. I always like find myself wanting to be around you. I don't understand why nobody else likes me. I just like to be around you. I just feel like there's something about you that I'm drawn to. What are you drinking? It's my favorite. It's mine too. There's two. Can I have some? my favorite too. Well, what are you doing later? Oh, no, I don't really have any plans. Well, do you... Hey, Ella. Hey, Josh. Why are you hanging out with this pale-faced loser? Dude, <gasps> don't talk to her like that. What are you gonna do? <laughs> oh! I think Wolfboy likes you. I don't know. He's not really my type. Do you want to go for a walk later? I don't know. I think I'm pretty busy. We're busy? I gotta go. Got to go. Ella, come back. Ella? What are you doing here right now? I haven't seen you in years. I know, I haven't seen you, I mean, since what? We graduated. What are you doing here? This is my spot where I always come to think. Oh, I thought I would check in on you. Oh. I mean, how's life, you know? Since we graduated high school, I mean, did you go to college? I did. It's, it's been good. How about you? I'm actually working as a nurse in the hospital. How's that going? It's good. I actually have a sample with me right now. Oh, you know, honestly, I haven't been able to stop thinking about you. Really? Yeah. Have I? I mean, have you ever thought about who you want to be with for eternity? I definitely have. Me too. Have you talked to that kid, Josh? Not really since, you know, we graduated. Uh, I have something to ask you. <gasps> Will you marry me? I don't know why I'm gonna say this, but... Yes! <laughs> We are gathered here today to bind you together in holy matrimony for the rest of eternity and more eternity and thousands of years. Edwin, do you take Ella to be your lawfully wedded wife? And Ella, do you take Edwin to be your lawfully wedded husband? I do. Edwin and Ella, you may now kiss the bride. I tried to save you, but I'm afraid there's nothing we can do for you now. No, please. I, 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 I can't die. Remember, Ella, your mom gave you this note, and she told you to read it on your deathbed? Give it to me. I think it's time. I can't pick it up. Can you read it for me? I'll read it for you. Dear Ella, your nanny beat you and made you a vampire. Sorry you had to live a rough life and I gave you up for adoption. But that's why. Hope we are all good now. Love, Mom. Oh, my sense. My whole life. I never understood why I was like this. And it all makes sense now. Oh, uh there's one more thing. The truth is, I could have saved you if I wanted to. <gasps> Marriage isn't for me. I couldn't be married for eternity. <laughs> Goodbye, Ella. Uh, uh, uh. I couldn't be married for eternity. I hope you die a sad life. Like and subscribe. <laughs>